the Lions. Ladies and gentlemen, we get things started tonight in the welterweight division, and we'll start in the blue corner. A wrestler who loves to ground and pound. This is Pat Bam Bam Healy. His opponent trained in the Militich fighting system and a very aggressive striker. This is Rory Marka. Let's check out the tale of the tape presented by Microsoft Xbox 360, the next generation of entertainment. Pat Healy doesn't see this fight going to a decision. He says that he has way more ways to beat his opponent than the other way around. Rory Markham has a different plan in mind, of course, and that is knocking his opponent out. So can Haley take this fight to where he wants it, or is this going to be a knockout by Markham? Both of these guys have a lot of power. This has fight of the night written all over it. Rory Markham in the yellow, Pat Healy in the camo. And Healy misses with a knee. Healy comes in with a 17 and 11 record, 1 and 0 in the IFL. Well, Markham comes in 10 and 2, 4 and 1 in the IFL. Markham has got some power in his hands. If he connects, fight's going to Speaking of connecting, Pat Healy. Healy going to work, grounding and pounding now. Very good here, and this is where Pat Healy wants the fight to be because he's very good on the ground also with the submissions. Rory Markham is in a lot of trouble right now. Can he survive this attack? Well, he's very tough and in a very good shape, so he might. But this is what Pat Healy should, uh, should do. Go half guard or even to the side mount and start working his submissions. Yeah, the referee should restart him in the center of the ring. That's what I would do because with his Rory Markham is there with his head on the, on the lowest rope. Absolutely. Referee Cam McCard looking in. Pat Healy drops Rory Markham early in the first. That's got to make Ken Shamrock happy. He will. He will. Make him count, Pat! Exactly what he said, watch the kicks to the face. I was, I was uh, afraid for it too. Pat Healy being very aggressive and taking the fight right to Rory Markham. But if you stand on your both feet, it's allowed for Rory to kick you in the head. So he has to watch out with that. Push, push. Trying an armbar there. And now the fight goes back to the stand up game. Circle! 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 No legs wide. Get slow! Get slow! And Healy's got his hands hooked behind the ropes. The referee will warn you. That was Roy Markham. Going to work on the net. Yeah, but there's nothing there. In fact, Healy knew it. That Healy should hit the body more. Bring his hands down. And Rory should try to push him away with his knee there and get up. This is not the place you want to be. Pat Healy oh. is a tricky submission expert. 11 of his 17 wins have come by way of submission. He's a very well-rounded fighter. Rory Markham was able to weather the storm. He took the hit, and he's right back into this because we have 30 seconds left in the first round. Healy trying to land a couple bombs from the top. And Rory Markham holding on as we come to the end of round one.
The IFL on FSN is being brought to you by Microsoft Xbox 360, the next generation of entertainment. By Fairtex Gear, be inspired. And by Sandals Resort, love is all you need. Run, Crook and Boss, Root and Ringside and Boss. Roy Markham missed his last fight when he had to have retina surgery. He may be showing some signs of ring rust. Yes, he absolutely, absolutely does. But Pat Healy, come on, man. He really takes the fight to him. I mean, he rocked him with that punch, then got the takedowns a few times. He's really good on the ground, very difficult to get off. Ooh, difficult fight. The defending champions have their silverbacks up against the wall. Let's go back into the ring for round two. 